A first and 10 Friday night in a mountain empire collision has our attention for game of the week. 10 sports Eric Johnson is an independence to break it all down for us. Hey, Eric. Hey, Alyssa, George With has a five-game win streak against Grayson County dating back to 2019, but I can tell you the Blue Devils have a lot of confidence entering tonight's matchup, bolstered by this brand-new turf field here behind me and third-year coach Stephen James. I mean, I think people are starting to see that we're not playing around. Um, you know, we just got a good group of kids. They work hard in the weight room and uh, do what they're supposed to there, and obviously that, that leads to a lot of your success. Sitting at 8-0, the battle-tested Blue Devils are getting used to what a winning culture feels like. Their hard work, paired with dedicated coaches, yielding rich results. We just bought in. We all trust our coaches. They're great dudes. I have respect for all of them. That's really, it's really up to, it's all on the coaches. They, they, uh, they brought our program back. There's no doubt in that. Not only did they bring the program back, they brought back Dowell as well. The signal caller quit football his freshman year, returning thanks to James and his staff. I just I respect for the coaches they want me to play. And I, and I couldn't let these guys down, of course. Tonight, all about revenge. The Blue Devils were in this very spot last year when the Maroons handed them their first loss and another loss in the Region 1C Championship. George Witt then went on to become state runner-up in Class 1. I keep telling everybody on the team, man, it's a mentality. you got to have a good mentality, man. You can't be afraid. You, can't, you just got to do. There's lots of mutual respect between both of these teams here tonight. You'll recall, of course, Coach James is a George with alum. He even helped that coaching staff during the COVID year before coming here to Grace. And we'll see how it all unfolds as these two, uh, these two squads go head to head. But for now, we're live in Independence. Eric Johnson, 10 Sports.